Hi, this is Baird from Rhinestone Alphabets, and I would like to show you how I would approach making this design using TrueType fonts from my website. So first of all, we're going to take the um, text tool, and we are going to type in the medium outline combo font, which is um, right here on the top. And I'm going to type the word class of with my caps lock on. And this is the way it's going to type out. And again, this types in at 144 points for an SS10 stone. You want an SS6 or an SS16. I go to my website, you just use the point value that's under Corel Draw, and it will take you right to the right point value. So then the second part of this is the inside, and the way these combo fonts are set up is if you go ahead and duplicate this, <clears throat> and, and then just backspace out of it, I want you to take your caps lock off, and now you're going to type the inside of the word. And this is perfectly lined up, the way these are set up. I have set them up so that they match perfectly. And um, so that takes a lot of the work out of making this design. So once you have the two parts, of course, you're going to notice something right away, and that is that I have squeezed this quite a bit smaller because this is too big for me. It's 10.2, and I want it to get it down to about 9 inches. So go ahead and ungroup each part of this. And I'm going to show you what I do. I think this part of it's still grouped there. There you go. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just basically uh, let's let's move this out of the way for a minute. <clears throat> We're going to take our cursor and just kind of grab each of the groups and try to pull them in as much as we can. Next word. And then the last uh, two, I guess. Okay. Now we got that the way we want it we need to group each of those colors separately. So what I want you to do is put your shift key down and then you're going to grab the inside first. And you can see my I'm touching just the inside. And then you group that. And then you're going to go to the outside. Silhouette's somewhat intuitive. It can tell what you're going to do there. And then you're going to group that. <clears throat> so now you've got them separated out. All right. Now the last part of this design, let's just put this aside. We can make it if we can do that. The last part is the 2013. And the way you're going to make that is with the athletic large font that I have on my site. So let's just locate that. And once we locate that, that is uh, sized at 288 points for an SS16 or SS10. So go ahead and you're going to type out 2013. And now that is perfectly sized also. So, uh, let me see if I can make that move a little for us. Okay. So let's take that and we're going to take the second part and just put it right and there is your design. So I hope that that helps. And if you have any questions, 
feel free to email me at rhinestonealphabets at gmail.com. Thank you.